Hello and welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Point. My name is Eiken and today we're continuing our journey on the blind playthrough of Legendary Difficulty. It is time for another Haven defense. The Pandorans are attacking us left, right, center, everywhere and I will not let that happen. I won't stay idle by to just accept that. We got an <coughs> attacking strength of 16 and almost no defending strength, uh, which tells me this is going to be a pretty interesting mission. But we got our prime team uh, ready to roll. Now, in a defense mission, there are possibilities to actually capture quite a few of them. So let's load our neuralizers as it were feasible and our Sinadrian Neural Pistols will get some more ammunition. That's eight shots. Yeah, okay. And we'll even get one of the bigger enemies. So... Why can't you carry more, Euler? I'm disappointed in you. Need to raise the strength by one. Okay, perfect. Good. So just double checking. Uh, we had a few more a few more abilities here. Text from behind gain three times the damage. Well that's actually not too bad. If the enemy ever faces in a different direction, it's free damage, right? So I'll take that one. The Vanish isn't bad either. Move within five tiles and disappear from view for the next turn or until spotted. Okay, so I think we do have everything ready to deploy. Alright, we start in the middle of the map. Oh boy, we're already seeing the first enemies. Ugh. Not good. Well, let's start with killing frenzy, shall we? Okay, cool. So where are our comrades in defense? We got a priest over here. And that seems to be the extent of it. Wait, did I see someone down here? Good. Priest can induce panic. I like that. We're going to place you down here so that you can... Oh, I was right. There is someone. An assault. Moves up here. And let's position ourselves yes. right around here. Wait, two of them? Gosh, they are the worst. Correction, second worst. The worst are the Skrillers by far. We're moving up. Uh, the idea here of the disciple is whatever or whoever comes close, we just instill panic, right? Right. Good. Moving back. That got us two new characters and a nice little position up here. Good. Can we somehow get that witch down? Um, On the move. Moves up. Nine willpower. Mark for death is four. Is that worth it? I don't know. I 
I think not yet. I don't know what we're going to face for now. Let's just normal mode. And normal mode includes not going too crazy on everything. Let's blast them. On my way. In my sights. Good. Mind control is off. Um, is out, thanks to two very well pre uh, precisioned shots. Now it's slowly but surely getting the rest of the body down and ranks. Can start to pepper this guy. Because he has better shots. Grell. Does have horrible shots on both of them. Not good, but overwatching wouldn't have been great either, so might as well take the shot and just accept it. Um, in terms of overwatch, piss, uh, Anything that piss moves, overwatch here, all set. and handgun overwatch there. So he just breaks through, kind of ignores everything. We might want to ignore everything on this side as well. Okay, yeah, wow. Four enemies, but the Skrilla, the Skrilla is the ma main problem. Siren isn't great either, but at least it can't hit us with its stupid mind control. Are we safe on the roof against the Skrilla? We potentially aren't, right? Charged in. I've seen these things jump in the past. Hmm. Not sure. I I don't know. More enemies. Okay. Priest moves up. why we don't have a valid target for induce a panic targets need to have less um, well points than the priest okay well I suppose then we need to reduce the will points of these targets Good, let's get the tail down. That, of course, would be a nice hit. We could jump down and do that. It's a bit of an aggressive move, but I right think there. it's worth it. Good, 
minus five will points to everyone. This thing is still 50 will points. Okay, we're getting there. Slowly but surely. So what we need is kills, right? Right. Um, before we deal with a Skrilla, well, we partially can deal with a Skrilla, right? Um, we do have options like Warcry. its action points quite a bit so we can now focus on getting the rest down we need more kills that's the point so rep clearance Dilly will be our killing machine. The lean, mean killing machine. Target. That's three points used, two points gained back. It's an okay trade. is how can we kill more answer is likely by getting closer Saiken do three jumps and then melee attack oh, not sure if that's the right call yeah I got two enemies there one of which is very likely another Skrilla well, she started over here. I don't know if they can move that far. Moves to here to have no obstruction. Is that a solid shot? That's the opposite of a solid shot. Moves to here, tries again. Not getting a clear line of sight. That's annoying. That's it. Okay, finally. Armor penetration. Five times spread across an arc with a direct fire line. I would like to test that, but I also would like to keep uh, enough for adrenaline rush. Good, cool, let's get that shield. Looks like a charm. Proceeding. Good. 
Could hit the head, could simply go for that carapace. Uh, yeah, I think normal shot. I want to keep the willpower up. This would not be an overall kill. What else do we have? We have that guy, we have that guy. We'll come to you in a second. For now, I think I need to better my chances even further. Identifying target. How does that taste? Good, we still got more action points ready. Ready to fire. 180. Not enough to kill him. That is infuriating. Good. We're using more action efficient means. And the whole reason why we're doing all of this here is. I want to make sure that we're getting enough will uh, will point deduction from the enemy. All set. Yeah, that was a good turn. Overwatch. Overall, okay. Not incredibly good, but okay. Indirect fire, hits the Skriller, removes armor, all good. Still can't hit anyone properly. Could go down here. It's not the best, uh, not the worst idea. Could also start carefully preparing for melee. That thing is tough. But for now, I really think we need to kill the others, the other enemies. That's the main goal. He takes one turn. Yeah, we hit that guy really, really well. Good. Not good. I want to keep them alive. Possible. That also is not good. A couple of developments that are not really going according to plan. Okay, not the perfect turn. I will admit that did not go according to plan.
let's start hitting the guys inside. What I did is almost uh, explode our own grounds that we're standing on. Not very good. We need more will points overall. Five by five. How do we get that guy? Tell you what. Dilly needs to do it. War crying. All three of them are losing their, their direct turns. I'm here. Good. Now back to what we wanted to do in the first place, which is kill these guys. Target. It tells me that I can kill him. I'm not sure about that, but I'm willing to give it a try. Unfortunately, it lied to me. Just need the right angle. down Time to slam that guy to the ground the Skrilla is next but for now I need to stay out of line of sight as it is quite dangerous to be down here Overwatching. And Shadow Realm can also go into melee next turn. Dilly helps with that flank. We need to kill both of them. to die as well. That was your last mistake, I can promise you that much.
Good, let's start over here. Everybody got a will point back. Fantastic. I'm prepared. Here I am. Let's do this. Come get some. Very good. Uh, I do have a couple of ideas. How about this? And then Dilly moves in. I can't take much more. Regains his composure. And quite frankly, to uh, two action points. Moves, kills, moves. Three reloads. Just need the right angle. Kills again. Oh, he's on a spree. I like that. Ian moves up, and we need to prepare this guy. Dilly is a monster. He just doesn't stop. Doesn't take no for an answer. No compromises either. I think what we will do here is recover. Where we'll, we will need some more Warcry next turn, right? We have enough for war cries, so that should be fine. Just waiting here to not block the exit. Good. Uh, let's say Dilly just moves over here. It's okay, there's no. That guy doesn't have a ranged attack. I'm here. Advancing. Ready to fire. Trying to get the armor off of uh, the back of the creature. Overwatcher. I'm on the move. And we'll move as far away from the 
uh, mind flayers as possible. Grell on the other hand moves in. Warcry here, no, but we do have we do have a a decoy, and that might become helpful later. Look, I'm just going to Overwatch in anticipation of that thing doing something. Good, so we cleared house. Uh, the only thing left over is to deal with the Skrilla now. Skrilla and Manila, as they say. It's a huge boxing match. <sighs> We're trying this guy. And I would like to rest here because we need willpower back. Getting eight willpower back is huge. That will help us a lot, like a lot. So we're moving closer. here our disciple doesn't have a med kit which I really think he should have can't lob a grenade let's pull this guy to the outside Cypher is the one who would be tanking him if anything ha was about to happen. Solid shot, but not a hit. So we're removing all of the armor from his back. Quick aiming is okay. Still want to remove the armor. Dominant is down, and since we have one action point left, we can overwatch. Uh, we will need willpower to provide actions to others. There's a mind sucker in here. I positioned both of our immune characters right in front. And I want to capture this guy. Shred 30 points. Okay, what would this here shred? Oh, th that thing shreds 30 points. Okay, I, I got you. Good word, just taking a normal shot then. Pretty well, pretty well armed with that guy. Uh, 
Um. Hmm. Not f fantastic odds, really. I will use the will points next turn, Ready so we're just going to get like one shot here. Torso, head, torso, head. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. You know what? Not ending yet. Overwatch. Overwatch. Now we're in. Ian will be the one war crying the most. So far we haven't really seen much of the Skrilla. Okay, I'll just going to position ourselves correctly. Garner will points that's not good either. Drinks. We need to get rid of those smashers here. That guy played a bit too much um, with uh, smash yeah. or pass. Let's do this. He always chose smash. Despite this much. Nope, that's not shredding. We need threading shots okay what we can do from up here is start hitting him 390 I mean look I get it I get it he's hard to capture but do you think that's a bit over the top? Not sure if I have enough ammunition to even get him down. But yeah, we'll get there eventually. Uh, recover. Because we need more war screams. Butcher. Okay, so that guy moves in. We're ready. Grand moves to here, so next turn she can be healed by someone else. I'm here. Taking a Having a good uh, line of sight here. Moving to coordinates. That's much better. I want to use our pistol. Uh, our <laughs> paralysis pistol. Okay, we're at forty-two. Perfect, but we will be getting there. <laughs> War cry is successful. Uh, 
Um, tell you what, we will recover yet again. Ready, sort of. Got the leg. Got the carapace. Heading out. Trying to aim. There's the spawning abdominum. shots here switching out reloads and we can't shoot again Okay, well... There's still a wall in the way and I was hoping <coughs> we could get that out of the way. Starting to shred the smasher, that's really what I'm trying to do. Get rid of all of its stupid armor. Ready to engage! Does that gun even shred? I am not sure. We do have four will points. We don't want to let it bleed. That's not our intention. Moving to here. And she's just healing herself. Not the best use of the turn, but he's in a weird spot where I have a hard time just getting him down. far more reduced that's what I was hoping for and in the turn it still stays there interesting just need the right angle Ready. 
Heading out. So that should be a better angle. Don't want to waste our precious paralysis shots. Gotta focus. That stupid mist will not help him, not this time. Identifying target. Reloading. I should have brought even more ammunition. I was on the break of uh, thinking, well, that would be great, wouldn't it? Reduced quite a bit of armor. Moving up. Still trying to get these smashers down. Um, in terms of shout. I mean, this shattered drum who does the shouting, and we're just recovering here. Here I am. Let's do this. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, reloads, uh, which brings us to Shattered Realm, who's the only one left. I think we're actually okay for this turn. Okay. Good, we might be onto something here. That guy doesn't have enough time units left over we might be able to get the skriller down for good Just need the right don't want angle. to miss any of the shots more mist coming Good. One, two, three, four. And Overwatch. Okay, cool. So, War Cry. And once more. Followed by a nice little grenade. Very good. That creates uh, the vision that we need. up okay perfect perfect so what I want to do now is adrenaline rush we 
we damage the smasher. Shotgun to the face slash smasher in this case. And it's gone. Now, continuing with that other smasher. Minus 20 armor, but is good. Tell you what. Um, let's send over two more shots, shall we? Well, one more because we were out of ammunition. Question. Starting to remove uh, uh, armor from the torso, I suppose. <clears throat> He's clearly mad or crying. <sighs> Getting ready for more war cries. Smasher gets injured quite heavily. Grell moves far enough away so that we're not in the center of uh, his attention. Ian continues to move up and Ready to fire. we're peppering it with more and more of our shots. Two hundred out of three eighty. Okay, we're getting there slowly but surely. Holding position. Just need to make sure that we're not dealing too much damage to his vital organs. Don't want it to bleed. Don't want it to. Finger on the trigger. To lose anything but its smashes. Ready, sword. One. Switching ammo. Reload. We're still having ammo. That's good. Just need the right angle. There he is. Four. So, if I do understand paralysis correctly, that means he saw about halfway, a bit, a little bit more than halfway in, and the war cry removes two of his action points, which means he has like one action point to work with, really. Uh, that's not a lot. Don't want to waste any shots, so 
We're actually ending turn here. All set. And we're good. Smasher is almost completely gone. I would like to do another adrenaline rush next turn. So we're recovering. Good, both of its melee attacks are finally gone. Now, I think it's still time to do a bit more. Armor removal. Good, let's recover so that we do have plenty of uh, willpower left over. I'm here. And I don't want to even take any chances of missing him, so Dilly moves over. And this is a 100% hit. Taking aim. Just out of curiosity, because I don't want it to be a problem later. Let's take the last two armor away from the abdominum. Not that it blocks anything. Because it seems that armor is just reducing uh, the effectiveness. the effectiveness of uh, the paralysis. Moves up. Adrenaline rush. any action points but that's okay um. yeah we can't hand over action points here either but we can war cry we have plenty <laughs> Of willpower. Don't want to kill the leg. Instead, we're taking the carapace down. Okay, I'm just trying to get 
armor reduction on all of the parts. Now with the torso uh, done, it's even easier to, uh, to get it on all sides. We're out of ammunition on that side. Taking aim. Almost at three hundred. Taking aim. Out of ammunition as well. Hmm. Where are our frontliners? That's one, and that's two. Killing frenzy and end of turn. Keep it together, operative. So he's pretty mad about uh, being taunted the entire time. Can understand that. Moving up with uh, Jarenks, and just in case uh, this guy has any ideas. Yeah, I can't fully charge up. Not yet. Doesn't have melee attacks, so we actually should be okay. It's bleeding for 60 though, so can't wait for too long to get something going. Fortunately, I haven't brought enough ammunition. That's a uh, that's a real regret that I do have. the mist I think we can stand here I don't think he has any melee attacks left one two three war cry to remove at least two of his actions Giving him another target right over here, just so that you do have options.
I think we had a shift of action points over here. We can do that next turn. Rest. Yeah, we don't need more. We don't need more melee power. More damage. We need. more stun. On the move. Okay, I think we're fine. Let's see. No, the guy couldn't do anything. Perfect. One. <laughs> Three. And I think we've just caught ourselves a Skrilla. Yeah! <laughs> Biggest experience payout that I had ever. Wow. Wow. That was a good mission. The A team that we do have is supreme. Imagine two more uh, people with actions on it. That would just blow it completely out of the water. I need more ammunition on the um, taser guns. And we got a Skrilla. Nice. I have failed oh. to identify the organ. I come bearing a message from the voiceless Hierophant. Words do not matter. Everything written is ash. Everything spoken is wind. But your actions show promise. Okay. Let them we'll do that. The voiceless Hierophant will be pleased, and you will gain new insights and come closer to the perfection of the body. May your journey to the blind leg continue. Okay, how does diplomacy look in general? Supportive, supportive, and we're kind of not that hot on New Jericho anymore. Need to fix that. A new religion. Berserker class is now available. Yes, uh, uh, we want to do that right away. New melee weapons, okay. Priest class is now available, uh, okay. Yep. Food production facility. Hmm, that sounds also interesting. Mutation lab, okay, we got all of the good, uh, good stuff now. Berserker, Mutation, and then a new Priests. Okay, cool. Skrilla. Damage inflicted on Skrilla is increased by 10%. Okay, well, let's first do the shared re uh, research. That'll already take a while. And that can happen afterwards. Cool. Okay, in terms of personal, still, we still need a bit more um, power. So. First of all, let's do some trading. Uh, uh, still need a bit more power on our main team. One thing that I was uh, considering here is actually make the main team kind of a full robot uh, team. That would be awesome. Uh, we wanted to have a few changes here. 
Very few changes, that is. I think we already got the right uh, the right legs here with him. Yep, the propeller legs. I think we wanted to go... Oh, Drenks doesn't even have a chance for propeller legs. Okay, never mind. Yeah, but for our snipers, if you look at the augments, Propeller decks are an obvious one. Fortunately, the accuracy goes down a bit. Question is, is it maybe worthwhile going? That would reduce speed though, but accuracy is increased and the immunity to goo is fantastic. Um, This torso here has a lot of accuracy. Kind of makes up for uh, the accuracy lag on the Mirage legs. I'm just thinking the mobility that you get out of these guys is insane. In terms of in terms of uh, options here, accuracy is on par with your normal helmet. I think you're we're just going with a normal helmet, although mind control immunity is nice. But I think for the snipers, it's almost like accuracy with torso and mirage legs, which would be an immediate upgrade uh, to Dilly and Euler, uh, the last two non-modified ones. <clears throat> we would have Jarenks and Grell as the midfield immune to mind control, just needing to get <coughs> the right uh, things uh, going, uh, the, uh, the right weapons going. And in Grell's case, I suppose, um, it, it's also a matter of the adrenaline rush is absolutely fantastic, really, really strong. So here it's more a matter of um, giving her the right equipment. I think we wanted uh, boom blasts. So who had the second? Uh, the second Goliath. I said it once and I'll say it again. It's a very finicky system where you're just going through lots and lots of soldiers to find who is having a specific piece of equipment. seems the second Goliath. Shattered Realm has one, but who has the second one? Oh, Butcher owns. Okay. Well, the Butcher really is more of a melee frontliner. Um, and we wanted to play him as such. Does this here really help him? He could uh, use it, I guess. He does have a torso that allows for melee combat and he also once getting the right legs um, he definitely should be good to go at the moment oh at the moment we already have propeller legs Yeah, we already have propeller legs. Okay, anyways, he already has uh, the right legs. Yeah, I'm... I'm thinking if it would be just from getting clear classes with clear actions. Just making her... Uh, 
a ranged damage dealer. We could use heavy lifting. Boom blast wouldn't be bad either, but we already got adrenaline rush, so that's fine. She needs more strength. We're running out of ammunition, definitely, rel relatively speaking, quickly. The Hell Cannon is fantastic for what she's trying to do, but 12 shots aren't that much. Um, equally, 18 shots here aren't that much either. The hammer, however, is important. We will need others to heal her for now. Good, which brings him into the position of actually using melee more because he would be uh, a melee combatant having two of these. Shadow Realm is a hybrid. He can also he can melee and um, use uh, use the rocket lawn, uh, the grenade thrower. I like the idea of the decoy here. Worked very well so far. Shadowed Realm onslaught might not be a bad idea, but uh, what's even a better idea is this character. He has phenomenally low willpower for his shouts and his jumps, so we need to upgrade that. Bonus healing, it's not bad. And two willpower that would hit two birds with one stone. The onslaught, however, is also good. Let's get the willpower first. I think that that's helpful. Even more willpower thanks to the helmet. Um, and he could actually be a healer. Melee and healer. Um, we're okay here with Dilly. Grell is fine. And we're fine here as well. Good. That team is doing super well for themselves. Moving to here. Cool. So what are the other teams doing? Moves to rescue. Moves to rescue. Moves to rescue. Okay. All of you guys take a chill here for now. And Phoenix Point, we'll just take the vehicle and we'll do some trading. Of is under Good, we'll get there in a second. Cool. We got the Berserker class, which I think now we could also use as a second class. Is that correct? So don't have the points, but I assume yes. Ranks. Ian the Butcher owns Dilly G, Grell, Euler, everyone. Prime team ready to go. And we're moving there. Let's explore our options. And that'll be 
Haven is under attack by the pure. Well, that is that is a new faction. I like it. We're going to yet again incur a little bit of a negative reaction from New Jericho, but we should be fine overall. Let's do the Haven info here. Oh, apparently. They are, they are attacking. Hmm. The pure? I think we destroyed them, didn't we? Now yeah, they are starting to be very hostile to one another. That's not good. But two of them are still highly supportive. It's unfortunate. I actually liked New Jericho, but we never really. Uh, could get these things going. We need to get their mission done. Um, actually, need to get their mission done. So, just double checking. What? Phoenix Point is also under attack. Good, but we can fly here, defend, come back. That's okay, that can be done in 10 hours. Okay, well. Uh, too much happening at the same time. Good, down here, <clears throat> we're being attacked. We're attacked over here. Who is taking care of that, by the way? Okay, we're f already flying there, which is fine. Haven info. Now we're, we'll be we'll be there in time. It's yet again that the game is just uh, kicking a gear up, uh, but we do have enough teams to withstand that assault. But yeah, we're, let's play this one here out, and after the defense, after the defense, I think we'll, I think we'll actually fly back and heal up. But I could also see the mutane, uh, the mutane field. Uh, oh no, I know we wanted to fly over and help over here so yep no it's defense and then flying over we're a little bit shy on resources on this end only two teams that cover everything seems seems like a little bit too less but then again how many more soldiers should i uh, take under under my wing they all need food and equipment so yeah that's a problem Okay, anyways, anyways, if you need uh, food uh, and don't have a problem uh, other than needing food, hit the like button and uh, help feeding the soldiers in this campaign. Thanks a lot and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.